Hey guys, what's up? Do you know what Discord is? If you've clicked on this video, I'm pretty confident that you know what Discord is. But still, I'll let you know what Discord is. Discord is an instant messaging social platform where you can talk and hang out with your friends or communities. And to make the interaction even more fun, we use chatbots. And throughout this series, we'll be learning how to create Discord chatbots using python so let's dive right into it to create our bot we'll be using hikari now hikari is a relatively new discord api wrapper so i too will be learning as we go ahead but do not hesitate to ask any any questions down in the comments now i'll provide a link down to hikari's official website where you can find its documentation which is this and a link to Hikari's github page. So first of all to create a bot we need to create a bot uh, we need to create an application on the discord's developer portal which is this and you can find the link to that in the description as well. So first of all we need to go ahead and create a new application so we'll do it right here let's name this bot core and we have finally created an application the next step is we have to go to this column bot and add bot so we're building a bot let's hope this name is not taken too much And as you can see, we have finally created our own bot. So if you want to customize your bot, you, if you want to change its icon, change its username, you can do it all over here in this bot tab. And you can just click on it and select an image and change the image. You can change the username. I can write core one, two, three, anything. And when you're done, you can just click save changes and your bot will update in real time. But let's leave it for now and go set up our bot. So I have come to Visual Studio Code. You can use any code editor that you prefer. So let us create a new file. Let's say main.py. The first and the most important step that we need to do is we need to install the Hikari package. So I'll quickly go ahead, open up my terminal. And let's go back to the Hikari's GitHub page and see what are the installation instructions. So for installation, Windows users may need to run this command. So we'll quickly go ahead and copy it and paste and I'll run. So as you can see, I've already installed. So it did not go through the installation process, but you can, you have to just copy it and paste this command and Hikari package will be installed. Now that our Hikari package is installed, let us go ahead and set up our bot. So I'll quickly go ahead and write import Hikari and bot equals to Hikari dot gateway bot and token equals to and we'll leave it as an empty string for now and the next step is bot dot run so what this does is we are importing hikari and then we are initializing our bot which is hikari dot gateway bot and then we have to enter a token remember the token that we created when we created our application into a bot on the discord developer portal that token will go right here but before doing that let's head back to the developer portal so let's head here and we need to go here to the o or 2 and to the url generator and we'll select bot so what this does is we are creating uh, we are going to add our bot to our server so let's let's for now give the bot an administrator permission i'll click copy 
and a new tab so see as you can see we have opened a discord uh, tab which and now it is asking us to select a server in which we are going to add our bot so i click quickly go ahead and select bot testing server and continue and authorize i'm obviously a human Right, this seems all and we are done quickly close this and now if I go ahead to discord you can see a wild core appeared so as you can see we have finally added our bot to our server but do you notice the bot is currently offline so now what we are going to do is we'll go back to the developer portal and we'll go to the bot tab and we'll click reset token and I'll copy it now we'll go back to our code remember we left a blank string for the token now we'll add a token to it as such and if we run this code now all right i think hikari's it should be small let's try and running that again as you can see our bot is our code is running it's it's telling us the application version and it's running on amd64 windows 10 and where it is installed and documentation and support discord and as you can see the bot has finally ran so if we go back to discord you can see the bot is online we have successfully set up our bot and added it to our server in the next video we'll be talking about how to create event functions so stay tuned for that and if you have any doubts any any questions along the way you can simply ask them in the comments below or i'll provide a link to the discord server of hikari and obviously the github page and the official website so that's all see you in the next video